welcome to the Jake Games Stram. I forgot to turn the mic on. God dang it. I have to redo my intro. <laughs> oh, that's butts. But anyways, yo, what's happening, guys? Welcome back to another episode of The Lord of the Rings Return to Moria. If you guys have missed out on any, like always, go back, check out the playlist, get yourself caught up on the ones you've not yet seen. Uh, we got Cap in the chat. Yo, what up, Cap? Turbo said, uh, gotta go for now. See you later, partner dwarf. Hopefully Turbo will pop back in at some point. Uh, but anyways... Yeah, we're today the plan is I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to head back to the base, get my stuff fixed up, drop off some of this junk that I've got on me, and then we're going to go explore deeper into that crystal cave sort of area. Caps is finally here. Yes. Uh, you missed out on the Red Dead, but um, you're here for this at least. Let's see. Where's uh, Where's the best place to travel to? I think... I think it's going to be this one because it's, yeah, it's not too far away. So we're going to travel to here and then we're going to, from here, go back to base. We're going to get our stuff fixed up. But how are you doing today, Cap, by the way? How's everything going? Cap says I should ban Jake. Yes, absolutely. If anybody needs to be banned, it's definitely, oh, I fudged up. I went to the wrong one. Um, okay, it was this one we wanted to go to. Yeah, if anybody deserves to be banned, it's definitely Jake. What the heck is he even doing, man? <clears throat> like, he's been putting on this southern accent and playing this game called Red Dead Redemption 2. It's crazy. There is, um... You know, you've got Jake Games... He's out here playing these games and doing all this crazy stuff, um, putting on cowboy accents, wearing a cowboy hat, and playing the game. It's it's kind of bonkers what he's doing, man. I would ban him if I was you. Where am I? Is my... Oh, there it is. I was like, dude, where'd my base go? Is there no more... Entrance to my base. Uh, Cap says, good. Finally Friday. Uh, had almost every final exam this week. Networking and physics remain. I have to study. Oh, yeah. <clears throat> Definitely. Study up, buddy. But, yeah, I, I know how it is. Like, when you're coming to the end of the school year, they got, like, they go crazy with the freaking exams. But once you're done, you'll be uh, on summer break, right? So... That's good. How long How long do you get? You guys get a decent summer break, don't you? Alright, there's everything kind of repaired up. What I can do is I can put a lot of this stuff away. Got a lot of stuff that I don't need to be carrying on me. A lot of black diamonds. Ooh, we're out of space. We'll keep that. We'll keep that. We want wood. I want a decent bit of wood, I think. Because uh, the wood's good for, you know, building some platforms, I believe. That ought to be good. Um, oh, another shield I can put away. I don't need to have multiple shields now. Kind of chilling on that. Uh, Cap says, but pass math exam, 100%. Nice, dude. That's sick. That's really good. Yeah! Yeah! That orc just said, yeah, for Cap. <laughs> Did you hear it? All right, we're going to get a nap. We're going to eat some food, and then we're going to go explore. I fudged up, dude. I started this episode uh, muted. I keep doing that because, like, when I take my in-between time, I mute my mic. So that way you're not hearing all the noises and stuff of everything going on. And uh, I forgot to unmute it. So I did my whole intro muted, and then I had to come back and do it again. Uh, very proud of it because my average math exam is 60%. Hey, man, as long as it's passing, that's all that matters. Cap says, thanks, orc. <laughs> the orcs support Cap. Isn't that, isn't that good to know? 
that you're supported by by Orkage. So what's crazy is like there was people on Twitch too that were watching as I did my intro in silence and they didn't say anything. I get I get people on Twitch that just like don't chat ever. It's like they just see that I'm not, you know, that I muted it, but yet they don't like be like, hey, uh, you're muted, bud. Kind of bonkers. Man, I'm a. Uh... I'm ready for this Minecraft season to come out, to, to drop, you know, the Minecraft uh, update and stuff. Oh, fudge. Oh, fudge. That sucks. Cap says they just enjoy the stream. Yeah, but, like, they, <clears throat> they were here watching as I was silent, and then um, they just left. They didn't say, like, hey, you're, uh, you're muted. They just watched silence for a minute and then they left. Or you have toddlers on chat and they can't write. Maybe that's a possibility. Definitely a possibility. I can't believe I just jumped down and freaking died. That was butts. Well, from two weeks, it will be in month. Say what now? Yeah, I'm excited for the uh, Minecraft, you know, season three. If anybody wants to join, that's only 99 cents to become a member to help support the channel, but you also get access to the cross-platform vanilla Minecraft server. And Season 3 is coming. We're going to have 1.21 out. We're going to have a whole bunch of crazy stuff in the server. It's going to be a lot of fun. But yeah, I'm excited for a vacation in a couple weeks. I'm excited for Minecraft in a couple weeks. There's a lot of good stuff coming in June, and it's going to be very dope. Hopefully you guys are excited as well. Now I need to not die. How did my stuff end up there when I fell all the way down? See, like sometimes it's like you approach the ladder and you just you get onto the ladder. But then this other time I approached the ladder and I did not get on the ladder. Cap is excited. Heck yeah, buddy. <clears throat> Me too. Me and Turbo were talking about like how we're gonna um, how we're gonna do our our uh, our houses. You know, like how we've already been kind of planning out. I I did mine on the uh, previous server. Dang it! Like I kind of did a pre-design of what my house, what I want it to be. So I'm uh, I'm pretty pumped. I I kind of have the idea, like the layout of the house already set in mind. So it's just going to be getting on there and, like, building it, you know? All right, we made it down this time, alive. From building our dream projects, political discussions, and meetings, exploring, PvP. Oh, yeah, dude. All that. All that is coming. That and more. I'm looking forward to mini games. I want to build mini games like crazy. Now, what's what's the best way to get down to there? Do we have more ladders? Do we have a good way down? Can we just kind of parkour it down? I believe parkouring it. Whoa. I should have brought black diamonds. Because I bet there's going to be a uh, bit of a teleportation doohicker down here. Oh, there's a ladder over there. Hmm. The problem is, like, building. To actually build, you need uh, you need to have your, like, thing set out. You know, like, unless it's just these basic floors, you need to have yourself a, a hearth. Which is kind of butts. And this, I can't even, like, build it anywhere. How do they expect you to get down here? Is 
This is kind of crazy. Have I made mistakes by just jumping in? How do I get down farther? Oh, I made it to here. Yo, this is <laughs> this is sketch. I don't want to die. Maybe we can do one of these. How do we rotate? Okay, that's not like really rotating it the way I had planned on rotating it. Okay, that worked. Kind of work our way down a bit. This is working. Yo, this is... Oh, fudge. Okay, I survived. I survived anyway. That is good. Made our way down. Uh, getting back up, man. How am I going to actually get back up? Fudge, we got this dragon butt all over the place, too. There's this door that we can kind of mine through. This is pretty good. Maybe we'll find something through here. Actually, what is gonna... There's gotta be something through here, right? Ooh. Spiders. Oh, there's spiders. This hammer, dude. This hammer is freaking sick. The hammer just dominates. Peter Karandija, welcome to the stream. Glad to see you here. How you doing today? Hopefully, uh, hopefully all is well. Look at all this. Oh, it's so nasty. All those little spiders that go running. So gross. Hate to see it. Natural fibers are handy, I believe, for a lot of stuff. So that's good. So what did I what did I gain from coming in here? There's this. This is not something I can mine, I don't think. Or is it? Oh, it's Petra. Did I say Peter? My bad. That's True Quartz. Is that good for anything? Uh, Petra says, good. How about you? Oh, I'm doing good, too. I'm doing good. It's a, you know, we're out here streaming. That makes for a good day. Stream days are good days. So I kind of, I kind of fudged up a little bit. I came down here, and I don't know if I have, like, a good way to get back up. And also, there's this dragon breath crap all over the place, which is going to be kind of bad. I'm going to have to, like, get through that somehow to get farther down. I don't rightly know what I'm doing. Do you play uh, You play a lot of this, Petra? If you got any, any knowledge that you can drop on me, that is uh, much appreciated. Found you randomly while browsing streams. Nice. Glad to, glad to see that, uh, that we get some new people finding us, you know? Finding out about the Jake game strems. I'm kind of just like parkouring my way down. I don't know how I'm going to get back up, but I'm just kind of going for it. You know what I mean? Uh, no, you don't play this? Oh, it's a pretty cool game. You a fan of Lord of the Rings? Even if you're not, honestly, a fan of Lord of the Rings, um, this game is pretty cool. If you're into, like, crafting, building, exploring stuff, you'd probably like this game. It's uh, It's got all those things. All wrapped into one Lord of the Rings-style game. So it's definitely, definitely cool. Hmm. My next maneuver down. I guess we can kind of parkour our way down a bit. 
I'll figure out a way up, I suppose. I, I'm sure, like, I can kind of just wing it, you know? Pop the eggs. I hate the freaking nasty little spiders that go crawling out. The big spiders are pretty gross, too, but... When you got the little ones when you pop the egg things, it's kind of gross. You got the arachnophobia, then uh, turn away. Epic battle against spiders. Fan of Barbie. Eight year old uh, mom giving me a phone. I'm using translator. Oh, okay. You are you are very young. I see. I see. What the heck is that? Can I mine that? Did I get wood from? Oh, you bass some wood. I've been looking to get the Ubassum wood. Oh man, that's sick. Okay, cool. How did I get that Ubassum wood? What did I break? Oh, dude, was it? It's a like mushroom type thing, isn't it? Yeah, that gives you. That's weird. A mushroom gives you Ubassum wood. That's so weird. Ooh, can I dive down into the water? Will the water save me? Alright, well I need to remember that this is a Ubassum wood spot. Yeah, I fudged up. I put all my stuff back at base at home. I should have... What I should have done, I should have crafted myself a uh, teleporter. Whatever the heck it's called. Fast travel point. Because then I could have brought one down here when I get to my final destination. I could have just put that down, traveled my way back home. Okay, I'm going in. I'm going to go pop the eggs. There we go. Now we can take out the spiders. The spooters. These are like the spooters that give Spooderman his, uh, his powers. That's what they kind of remind me of. They are looking a little bit blue and red, aren't they? Uh, in stream before this, there was a man saying adult things. I got scared. Are your family... Yeah, I don't ever... I don't ever say no bad words or things like that. Uh, some of the games I play are a little bit um, on the more mature side, but not like nothing super crazy. I myself don't do the swears and stuff like that. I say things like butts and frig and fudge. I don't say no no bad ones, you know what I'm saying? Well, I think worst case Ontario, I just, uh, while I'm down here, I'll just like die and then respawn back at home. And then from home, I'll make myself a one of the teleporter things. Well, I'm in darkness and tired. I kind of need to get myself a base set up or something, don't I? Um, what the heck was I saying? Yeah, if I need to, I'll die. And then I'll come back here with the teleporter and get my stuff. Parkour my way down, you know. And, uh... What the heck is this? Can I get more Ubassum? Ubassum wood? That is actually Ubassum wood. Dude, that's crazy. Uh, Petra says, Oi, thank you. Yeah, no problem. No problem, buddy. Um, I'm actually getting pretty close to the bottom here. Oh, I survived. Oh, my health is actually low. How do I go about getting the health up? Am I going to die? My health is kind of ticking away. I think I might die. I think I might actually die. Yep, and now I'm getting attacked by a bat. I've died. That was bad. Meh. 
At least uh, you just wake back up at home. That's that's pretty nice. Let's see here. Um, oh, fudge. How do I craft it? Um, I need a pack, don't I? My beard's going wonky. Hmm, what, what do I do here? Petra says fun. Oh, yeah, definitely. Most F. We're funny. You say funny. <laughs> it is kind of funny. I, I do have I do have some troubles out here. <laughs> People tend to laugh at my at my pain. I'm trying to think how I can go about this. Uh, I need a pack. How do I get a pack? I think what I need to do. Um. Hmm. How do I make a pack? Oh, I can make map stone here. Okay, let's just do that. Oh, no, wait, no. I need to... I see. I need to set up a base. I need three black diamond, 20 stone. Okay. So I'm just going to take three black diamonds with me. Where's black diamond? Didn't I put some in here or no? Maybe I put them somewhere else. Okay, we need one, two. Uh, how do we left control grab one? Okay, we grab three of those, right? And then I should have stone. How do we make a stone hearth? Uh, why does your head look like potato with beard? That is exactly what my head is. That's why. We need stone, coal, and wood scraps. Okay, I should have stone. I need coal. Let's see. Let's just take that stack of coal. Why not? And let's go. Uh, we're going to head our way back down there. We should hopefully have the stuff I need to make a hearth and then to also make a travel stone. We're going to do it all the way at the bottom, I think. I think that's going to be the way to go. So we'll have a good way to travel, you know, there and back. Let's go. Crystal Descent. We'll see you later, uh, Petra. You have a good day, buddy. Take it easy. Appreciate you popping in and such. Hopefully we will see you later. I'll be here uh, for another... Another... Uh, I don't even know how long. How long will I be here? We'll see. Maybe I'll be here until I get myself set up down in the in the depths down here. In the crystal descent or whatever the heck. Yeah, it's called the crystal descent. I gotta like parkour my way all the way back down there though. That's gonna be kind of uh, kind of a little bit of a struggle, but we'll, we'll we'll make it. Is that what the heck is that? Is that like coal? I don't know if I've attempted to mine that before. I gotta be careful about this also. You know, parkour my way down, but in a smart way. Ah, uh, you know what? I think it's the purple stuff that ended up killing me in the long run. So how can I avoid that? Is there any way that I can actually avoid that? Maybe over here? Oh, I still hit it, didn't I? No, wait, I didn't. I missed it. Okay, cool. I found a, a way to avoid the purple-urple. 
Very nice. I took a little bit of damage, not much. Oh, I should have, uh, I never even checked out what this said. This is a wizard mark. Uh, these rooms are marking the wizard. Away down into the deeps, there is a faint foulness to the air. Wizard searches for Thrain. Gandalf. Hmm. And that's what that one says. Interesting. Foulness to the air is not good. It's never a good sign, because, you know, when in doubt, you follow your nose. So we got some, like, foulness to the air. That's that's never good. How did I get farther down? Did I go this way? I believe I did go this way. Yeah, this looks good. Getting close to the death spot. I'm thinking that, like, at the very bottom, probably, is where I should build a base, right? Now, how do I get down from here? Did I fall down? Is that why I died? Or Oh, no, it was because uh, the dragon stuff kind of kept ticking away at my health and killed me. There we go. get this inventory all sorted out we want hammer pickaxe axe torch uh, we want foods over here that's good over there we want to put this back on I wish you could just shift click it on but it doesn't work that way for whatever reason uh, we should be should be good to continue on how do I get farther down do we have to do another bit of parkour. Maybe we can do a bit of building. Build a bit of a wood floor here. That's good, right? No, it didn't work. Right here? No, they just keep crumbling. Rotating them doesn't work. It just makes them... Frig, man. Why am I getting hurt? Bone cold. Oh, it's cold. That's why. Dang it, dude. I'm just going to jump for it. I'm going to end up freaking dead again down here. Why is it so cold down here? How do I get warm? I need to... I need to build. Okay, what I need to do, I need to build. Let's see. Uh, f we need... A stone hearth. And that's gonna be warm, right? God dang you, you friggin' bats. Fudge, dude. No, 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 no. Idiots. Dumb freaking idiot bats. Oh, you know what? I probably could have busted out my torch, right? That keeps you warm too, doesn't it? Why didn't I think of that? Oh, well, we're down here. We've got a stone hearth Ugh, down here now. Poor fella. Who's that? Honor oh, we'll honor the dwarf. That's always a good idea. Get a hero's token. Dawn is at hand. Yeah, I, I'm dumb. I should have thought about uh, the fact that I can use a torch to stay warm. Picking up some more of that Ubassum wood. That's pretty good. I'm going to need a new torch. Can I break? I, I kind of place this in a butts of a spot. Can I break some of this? I don't think that I can actually break it. I'm just going to mine stone from it. 
Oh well, that's all right. So what we can do now, we're, now that we're down here, we can do one of these. We will do it. Where do we want to do this? We'll do it over over here. That's a good spot. Uh, my torch frigged up. I need to build a new torch. Uh, wooden snow. Where do you actually get a torch? How do I actually craft a torch? I forget. You don't need anything to craft it, do you? I thought you could just build. Goals. Aha, it's here. There we go. So that's good to hold on to. Um, so now, like with this, we can activate this. We can travel back up to the top. We can travel back up to our other base. Yeah, this is good. This is very good. Um, we can use our torch to hopefully go venture a little bit deeper here. We can get all the ubassum wood we want because we got this right here. Pretty good, pretty good. What did I need the ubassum wood for again? I don't remember. We can bust through here. I could build a full-on base down here too, like get the same kind of stuff I had up top. Ooh, a statue we can repair. Mountain potato. Delicious. Mashed potatoes. The best. Uh, silver ore. We need a stronger pick. Okay, so we do need to up our pickaxe. We definitely need to do that. There's more of this purpley purpley stuff. Let's rebuild this. That should unlock us a new bit of armor. First age sword. I can go through the purpley purpley stuff, but it's not the best idea to do that. Well, I got the purpley purpley on me. All right, so this way doesn't lead to much except for that, which is bad. It does lead, what is this over here? Maybe more that we can check out over this way? There's natural fibers all over, which is a little concerning. That means spiders. I am tired. I should probably go build myself a bed and sleep. Ooh, new goal. Follow the pilgrim road. Oh, this must be it. The ancient pilgrim road. <sighs> is that a troll? I hope it still leads to the eastern stairs. The way back up. Is that a troll? Let's read a history stone. Throughout the first and second ages, dwarves from across Middle Earth would go on long journeys to celebrate Durin's day. The ritual path begins at Miramir, where Durin saw the great sign in the lake. Then it descends the eastern stair to the Tomb of Kings. Through the lower depths... That scared the crap out of me. <laughs> Dude, I heard whispering in like this year, and then all of a sudden the... Uh... Oh! Oh! Fudge! I was reading! You God dang it, why are you so creepy? You freaking anus hole. God dang it, dude, I will punch you right in the face. Absolute frig. I need a better weapon for this. Ooh. Yo, it's that that bad where my hammer is not a good enough weapon for this? That's pretty bad. Knock this one dead. Knocked this one dead. I don't want to fight that troll, man. I'm just trying to like listen to this conversation. Oh, this must be it. The ancient pilgrim road Arik talked of. I hope it still leads to the eastern stairs, the way back up. I haven't seen Eric in a while. 
What the heck is going on with Eric? All right, so there's that. That's kind of crazy. Dude, I need a better... I need to get, like, the first age sword, I think, for this. I need an even better weapon. So I kind of think I need to explore a little bit farther down here. I should make myself a bed and a food-making station, shouldn't I? I think all I really need is... Um, what the heck is it? Oh, we can do a furnace. We can do all the same stuff down here. Uh, we can do a camp meal table. Small table to serve meals as they come off the earth required for camp meals. Table to serve meals as they come off the earth or station required to cook meals. Hmm. I don't know. It doesn't. St like, what's the difference, really? We can plop that on down right there that should be nice and uh, can I cook some stuff mushroom stew let's make it up and then uh, we can also maybe make a bed a wooden chest would be nice elven chests are way better but a bed furnishing is that where that's gonna be or is that under wooden stone no, I don't think it's wooden stone. Bedroll. We need oh, we need more cloth scraps. That's what it is. Hmm. Where can I get more cloth scraps? I guess I could travel back home, get some cloth scraps, come back here and make a bed. Man, this is pretty good though. New new area. Like it seemed like it was a while that. Well, I, I kind of wasn't playing very consistently, but. I say it seems like it had been a while since I got to new areas, so this feels good to actually have something new to explore here. But we do with that comes more like deadly enemies, so you know we're kind of in a tough spot still. At least setting up down here a little bit, you know, with the map stone where we can travel from up there to. Oh, there was a... God dang it. I wasted my three... I could have built this one and not wasted uh, all those black diamonds. I have a lot of them anyway. It's not that big of a deal, but still. I didn't realize this was here. I had the right idea, at least. So this is the only way forward, really, is to go through, through here. Through the Pilgrim Road. So this is going to be kind of crazy. I guess what we could do at this point is we can head back home. Seeing as I need to sleep. My health is low. Uh, I did make me a meal though. Why did I make me a meal? I guess I wasn't expecting to have to run home. So we go back to... I think it's this one. Or is it this one? I don't know. I always mix up my map stones, like which ones are which, where I actually want to travel to. Uh, I picked the wrong one, of course. At least it doesn't cost you anything to actually travel, so that's, that's kind of nice. This is the one. This is where my main kind of base is. That, you know, like... They really don't give you much incentive for building bases now, do they? I built like this small one over here. It's not like a very, you know, like it's not like the nicest one in the world. It's just kind of like a basic sort of a wall. My, uh, oh, dang it, dude. Why are the spiders back? I hate that. When you go far away, the spiders end up respawning. But like their egg thing is gone. They should not be respawning. Yeah, I built this just as kind of like a basic one, you know? Like, it's nothing crazy. Um, but there's not that much incentive to build bases because you have to move so much. You know, like I built a little setup in my first spot and I was getting frigged up by orcs so much that I ended up 
just kind of having to leave anyway. I came here, got frigged up by orcs a lot still. Um, this is probably the most permanent base I've built, but still, it's like you, there's no real incentive to build crazy big bases because you're just moving from place to place. You know, you're just going to have to go set up a new base somewhere else. So you just set up little kind of camps, kind of. Maybe I should store some of this junk. Got so many uh, nature fibers. I'll keep some coal on me. Um, what else should I keep on me? Some of this, maybe. Some wood, definitely. Hide. Um, we have that bass of wood. I think I can get wood down there. Hmm. I don't know. It's probably good. We got some basic materials. So that's probably fine. My stuff has been repaired. Oh, I just ate a meal. I think we're kind of good to go. I need to unlock more... I only got half of the sword recipe, didn't I? Where? I wonder where you craft that. Do you craft that here? This mall I thought was pretty good. Like, that's what I've been using lately, right? Um, but I just picked up something for like a new sword. First age great sword. I need another fragment. Where the frig am I gonna find that? That's tier three. Do we get any better armor? I need like the helmet still. I haven't found, wait, why haven't I found any statues? I haven't found enough statues to be able to like get all the stuff unlocked. I don't know. Let me know if you actually know the answer. The question we all want answered. Why am I not finding enough statues? Do I need to like Where could I where could I find more statues? I've done like I feel like I've done plenty of exploration. I've been to a lot of area. What was this way? Did I? I went this way already, right? I don't remember what. This is just statues? Maybe there's more statues this way. I don't recall what was. what was through here. need a better pickaxe too. I haven't really unlocked better pickaxe. Why have I not unlocked better pickaxe? <coughs> oh, it's more purpley herpley stuff. I did run through here though, didn't I? Where the heck did this just take me? Oh, it's here. Right. There's no way through this. What do I do about this? Hmm. Love all these pathways to dead ends. So good. And that, like that should be a doorway that, but it just leads to nothing. Well, we did some, we did some good progress today actually. I feel good about this. We actually made it somewhere new. Wait, what is that? bird nest up there how do I actually get up at that 
I think I would have to build a platform. I don't know. Is it worth it to even build a platform to get up there to see what that is? I don't really know. Alright, I need to find my way back out of here. Get back to the uh, the main zone where I was, you know, doing further exploration. Back to the Pilgrim Road. I mean, I can. I know I can take the orcs out with my pickaxe. Or not my pickaxe, my hammer that I have now. But um, there's definitely a better weapon for the job. Will I be able to get that? That's the question. I'm sure eventually, right? Eventually I'll find enough statues. Get through the stuff. We gotta get through the crap. I hate that purple ear police stuff. Makes me hear voices in my head and I don't like it. I'm not a big fan of that. I gotta really think about this. Where where I will find more statues. Wait, that's a dead end. Cause I mean I know for a fact there's gotta be a lot more. But they've gotta be in like hidden areas or something. I think that's sort of my limiting factor at the moment is just the amount of statues I have. Did I get into this chest? I need... Ah, uh, there's another chest I needed a key for, too. I wonder if the chests... Huh. Where do I get the keys for the chests? I could have... Uh, yeah, I could have built a base here. I'm wondering, like, where the keys for the chests come from. Is it like that... There was that area where I was setting up those dwarf statues. I wonder if that is uh, something. I'll have to maybe look into checking that out. But uh, anyways, guys, I think I'm going to go ahead and call it a day for today's episode of the Lord of the Rings Return to Moria. So hopefully you enjoyed If you did, hit that like button down below. That helps me out a bunch. Subscribe to the channel and turn on the notifications so that way you're not going to miss out on any future streams or videos. Join Discord if you want to come by and chat. And uh, if you want to help support the channel, it's only 99 cents to become a member. That gets you a bunch of cool perks. You'll get access to a 24-7 cross-platform vanilla Minecraft server that you can join whenever you want. Or with me on Fridays is when I'm going to be streaming that primarily. Maybe on Tuesdays too. We're going to see. But Season 3 is coming. Minecraft 1.21 is coming in uh, the next few weeks. And so then we'll be popping onto that server again. Also, another good way to support, if you're interested, merch. We got cool hats. Very cool hats. Beanies. We got some shirts. All that cool stuff. Check that out. But uh, anyways, guys, thanks for watching. And hopefully I will see you in the next one. Peace.